little taste of California by way of Willimantic uh, today as we celebrate uh, Hispanic Heritage Month here in the Fox 61 by Carrier Kitchen. Uh, a mono taco shop in uh, Wyndham has been going strong uh, with this guy who, I, I don't know, nutsily, I should say, opened it up in the middle of COVID. Yeah, thank you for having me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is Eric Seguenza. Nice to have you here. Yeah, thank well, you. you. Good opportunity. I mean, we talk to chefs all the time on this show. We've had a few that have opened up in the middle of COVID. What, what were you thinking? Uh, we we uh, we wanted a little taste of the New England, so uh -huh. uh, we decided to move during COVID and. I figured it'd be a good opportunity to start a restaurant. Yeah. Um, if I can make it through that, I can basically a, make it through it. That's anything. a good yeah. attitude. Uh, you know, if you can make it then, you can make it anywhere. It's kind of like that song, a New York, New York. Now, uh, let's get started because yeah, we're going to do yeah. something. Now, you spent your life in California, in the San Francisco area. California, known for their fish tacos. So I would imagine this has to be good because if they're not good in California, they're going to run you out of the state. Oh, exactly. Exactly. Right? Which, exactly. wait a second, they did run you out of the state. So <laughs> what's going on here? I, so we're, we're frying up some uh, some haddock. Uh huh. Um, I like to use haddock or cod. Uh huh. Um, it's a it's a great flaky fish. What do you got in great. the batter? In the where? In the batter. In the batter. Okay, so we got we got beer. Um, we have which uh, I flour. always laugh at, but beer is really a good. Oh, good it's great. Why? Yeah. Because it really it makes it a little fluffier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Uh -huh. it, it makes it kind of pop a little bit. Okay. And it gives it a nice crunch. Mm -hmm. uh, it's it's not a flat batter. Yeah, and take uh, a look how quickly it is. Yeah, crunch, yeah, we're uh, we're cooking. Yeah. Uh huh. Now, so uh, we're well, oh, go, go ahead. ahead. We're gonna get some tortillas going too. These are homemade. Yeah. You, yeah. you do these every morning. Every morning. Yeah. When do you sleep? Uh, not much. Sleep? Not much. Yeah. Who needs sleep? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Talk about and and you're you're running the restaurant uh, with with your lovely fiance when she's not nursing over at Hartford Hospital. She's over there front of the house and exactly. she keep you in line. Oh yeah. 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 <laughs> you're, you're just in the back, just slinging tacos. And yeah, speaking exactly. speaking of, you do a whole bunch of different kinds. It is more than just fish tacos. Oh, we got it everything. Yeah, we got we got beef, we got pork, any type of protein you can mm -hmm. really think of. We're doing it. Um, this batter is a great recipe for not just fish, but for shrimp, for scallops. Um, you can all, all types of seafood. You know, it's funny because we have the recipe on our website, or we will at fox61.com for for the fish tacos and for the batter. And I would almost think that's a more important recipe to take away from here. Oh yeah. Because I'll admit, I can't make my when I'm frying stuff up, I can't make it look that good. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, yeah, I mean that's that's clearly you've yeah. done this a time. Uh, yeah, I've been I've been working on this batter recipe for right. a while. All right, we so. got about a minute left, so uh, that looks ready, right? Yeah, yeah, it's almost there. Yeah, so I got the tortillas; they're nice and hot. Okay, we're gonna add a little slaw to them. Mm-hmm. All right. Look at this. Now, how long do you want that to rest? You're not throwing it right there into the taco, are you? No, we give it a little. We give it a little rest, right? Uh, 45 seconds, a minute, uh -huh. just so it kind of settles down. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, the inside's going to be screaming hot. Right. Um, but yeah, they're looking. They're looking good. Good. So I'm going to pull them out right now. There you go. Let them sit while you're doing it. We'll again say, as we say, I love this. Let's taco about it. Uh, yeah. A mano uh, taco shot, in, which means. Uh, made by hand, a mano, yeah. And, and everything, you, everything you do there is by hand. Yeah, your, your yeah. hands. My hands, my cook's hands, <laughs> everyone's hands. We're wearing gloves, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> thank, you, thank you for that disclaimer. We yep. appreciate it. What are you doing to the? To, to so now we got to season the fish, right? right. Mm -hmm. You can't go wrong with Old Bay. I'm going to be, oh, that's you know, New so we're, we're, we're doing Old Bay on the on the fish tacos. Uh huh. Go go ahead, flip it. And you want to do it right when it comes out. Oh, so yeah, it so it's, sticks it sticks. Nicely. It, it, it kind of uh, cooks the, the seasoning a little bit, uh -huh. right? So we're going to go right onto the to the tortilla Look with the slaw. Oh, right? my. We I, have some uh, avocado right here. Uh-huh. Dress that up. Yeah, so we're going to do that. You could find, uh, and you know, and, and again, you know, we were talking about how you got to know your stuff for tacos coming from California. But especially up in uh, Wyndham County, Big Hispanic population. Oh, like huge, yeah. 40%, especially in Willimantic. So you best know your stuff, Eric. Yeah, oh, of course, and, yeah. And clearly, if you can open up in, in COVID and still be here a couple years later, thriving and surviving, and with beautiful tacos like this, he clearly knows what he's doing. So it, this is some micro cilantro right here. We get it at the local uh, Willimantic Wyndham Farmer's Market. That. We pick it up. The fish, we get it local also. Wow. That's
That is beautiful. I'm not biting into that yet. Cause, yeah, yeah, cause give it, it a little cause break. Because it, it is hot, but I will get one more shot of this because it is beautiful. Eric Seguenza is the owner and chef extraordinaire over at A Mano Taco Shop, which, by the way, that's the website as well. A Mano Taco. Thank you for coming. Yeah, in. thank you. Good stuff. Oh, my gosh. Erica, Rachel. Uh, one for me, and you guys can split the other one. <laughs> okay, we, we can split one. I, I'm okay with splitting. Yeah. There you go. 